we are a hands-on science center. Sometimes we'll do hands-on science center when we say that. And we really mean that all of the science and engineering in the museum is not only interactive, but it's being done by the people who visit. Well, Long Hall of Science is definitely a destination. Um, when you get here, you can explore. Um, the, uh, the view is fantastic alone. Uh, when you get inside, you can have uh, learning experiences and fun uh, with friends and family. So if you want to have a place to try science, to do science, um, to even be vulnerable and try some science, some engineering, some technology, some mathematics that you're scared of, or that maybe seems intimidating to you, we are the place to do that. Because here at the Lawrence Hall of Science, you can try something and if it doesn't work out, that's okay. Right now, our main exhibit is uh, the Design Quest exhibit. Uh, it is an exhibit about physics and engineering. It's an entire hands-on experience. Everything in the room is, is entirely open-ended. There's no right answers, but there are lots of really great answers. Since it's an engineering space, you can make things that don't work the first time. And that space is a space that embraces failure. My favorite thing about being here at the Lawrence Hall and my favorite memory of, of, of my time here is any time that I see that moment uh, in a learner's experience where they catch on to my point. Or I ask them the, just the right question at just the right time and I see the light of recognition in their face. Um, not necessarily about, oh, I've now learned this topic, but oh, I've discovered what the next step is, is my favorite thing. One example of, I'd say, a really strong foundation in, um, in math would be the giant geometry exhibit, which are basically um, different sized sticks that have connectors and you can put them together. It's open-ended, um, very uh, few limitations on what you can do. Um, today when you were up, upstairs, there was the Geometris um, yes, exhibit. Um, that's actually a, a product of a couple of, um, of grad students in the education department who are trying to develop ways to use technology, specifically in this case games, um, to embody geometry. At that exhibit, kids have to be the geometry. And by embodying it, hopefully they become more comfortable with it. So it's more accessible. When we opened in 1968, it was a very different time than 2018, um, both in a social sense and also in a scientific sense. Um, the way that we do science, um, as, as a humanity is different, the way that we engage science, especially with our youth, is different than it was before. Science is, is, a, is a part of our world. So the more that we, in our 50th year, can be thinking not only of what we were like 50 years ago, but what we're going to be like in 50 years from now, um, the better.